Hey everybody and welcome to the next Stellaris Nemesis gameplay as the foundation of Zrisha. Or Zri... Zrithra, not Zrisha. Anyway, last time we actually had surprisingly managed to pull out a status quo uh, win, which is pretty interesting to say the least. Uh, <laughs> definitely was their fault like they pretty much yeeted they essentially yeeted all of their stuff towards us and then just didn't win off of it it was weird it was a very strange situation that ended up happening to say the least but we have successfully kind of cut off good majority of all of this from opposing enemies so we're in a position to decline galactic hierarchy I guess we're going to also declare them our rival where are they at ah they're right here that's right <sighs> yeah, so... Confederation of... Oh, that's over on this side. Nice. Okay. I'm... I'm confused. I have no idea what happened. Right, anyway, so our battle is a little insane, but we managed to to make it work. <laughs> uh, I am honestly not sure how we managed to do it, but we did. So go us. Psy aliens, where are they at? Somewhere. Let's go ahead and we'll do that. Ah, right here. Yeah, I mean, I must admit, I was surprised that they decided to eat their own fleets and then basically allow me to set it, settle status quo and not lose anything. It was intriguing, to say the least. But it worked out for us, and we're more than happy. Especially since we are... Complete. Especially since we are, like, pacifist, so... Our ability to wage war is pretty limited. A rumbling. Receiving transmission. Uh, we do have. I'm actually going to go ahead and guarantee their independence. That should benefit us. I'm actually fine with this because. It will eventually allow me to hopefully vassalize them. Complete. And vassalization is definitely something we need to do. Alright. Uh, let's see. We got 100% habitability here. With pretty much anyone, actually. Uh, it is a Gaia world, so we'll just do this and we'll call this Gaia so one thing I am trying to do in all my Stellaris playthroughs from this point on is have unique names for for things I think the hierarchy of fleet cam likes us too right yeah We 
Which is funny because they're fanatic militarist, but they like us. Construction complete. So it's kind of whatever. So what are we probably looking to do? We are probably looking to like cut these guys down to size a little bit. Attrition complete. If we're uh, being perfectly honest. And right now I'm just kind of expanding as I need to. Our tech is at 218, which is so so. Definitely could use a lot more, but. A massive crater. We have dust caverns. Dust caverns allow more harvesting. War has been declared. A war on us. I unfortunately knew that was going to happen. Yeah, so the Fanatic Purifiers are definitely working their way towards us, which is kind of upsetting. Hostile fleet rumbled. Where did we find them? Oof, we don't have anyone. We don't have fleets right now, which sucks. All right, these guys gotta like get over here as soon as possible. Can we sell some moats? We can sell some moats. But it's still not really gonna be enough. Ah. Innovation rollout. Attrition complete. Attrition complete. Hopefully, my Corvettes can kind of be. Heading towards this way to like mitigate. Let's go ahead and build defensive platforms that'll delay them a bit. Yeah, I mean, being a pacifist empire and a bunch of fanatic purifiers kind of sucks. That's all I'm going to say. Oh gosh, they have so many fleets too. I don't think our defensive pact <sighs> The 
this is a tough playthrough so far. Oh, they did split up their fleet, so maybe. Starfish launched. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. There's obviously not a whole lot I can do. Construction complete. Kind of perfect timing. I don't know if I can complete. if I can save off this attack, then I think I'm okay. But that's kind of the problem. Starfish this. under attack. Actually, it might be able to hold it. This one, however, is falling. Incoming transmission. Sure. I don't know, do I build... What do I build on Titan? We lost Furcon. Oh, but they're backing it looks like, so maybe we get to Furcon in time to take it back over. Okay, 732, I'm about to send 800 fleet power of Corvettes. I basically just have to war of attrition them. That's all I can really do, right? Mm -hmm. 
Man, this is definitely not fair. Being stuck between two fanatic purifiers as a pacifist empire. I got Corvettes here at least. If these Corvettes and the Starbase can just hold off till. Innovation rollout. Till there's enough time, we can do this. I just need to hold off until the destroyers get there. And keep sending corvettes. Research complete. I You know what? I actually think we can't win this one. Yeah. I think we're done. We kind of got screwed on this one, just in between two fanatical purifiers. Because what? They can just swoop the rest of us. And that'll take me way too long to build up new fleets. Yeah, we just got screwed between two fanatic purifiers. There's nothing that we can actually do on this one. All right, then. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. Um, I'll get a new civilization made and ready to go here shortly. Yeah, that sucks. All right. Well, we'll see you guys later. Bye.